Hey guys, so I wanted to talk a little bit about getting sick and how to avoid getting sick. Um, the winter's coming up and people, for the most part, just expect to get sick. You know, you're going to be coughing, sneezing uh, with the common cold and you can avoid that if you want. Um, I used to get sick. I used to get sick probably three, four times a winter uh, and then I got fed up. I didn't want to get sick anymore. It's, it's, uh, it's irritating. It's not very enjoyable. So. I looked into it and, and basically found out if you strengthen your immune system, you can fight off virtually any cold or virus as long as it's fairly uh, common. So um, I actually haven't been sick in about four years, and I've been fully exposed. Uh, you know, people in my office get sick all the time. I'm around them, talking to them all day, and I don't get sick. Uh, and the reason why is because I've learned how to strengthen my immune system. Most people don't realize this, but 70% of your immune system is based on your gastrointestinal tract. That's your gut, your intestine, your large intestine, and your stomach. So if you can strengthen them up, have good bacteria in there, you can fight off basically any cold virus. Um, and how do you do that? Uh, well, you remove the foods that are damaging your gut. The foods that damage your gut are mostly grains, like wheat, rice, pasta, whole grains, to a lesser extent, legumes and dairy. So if you remove those three categories of food from your diet, you're going to drastically strengthen your immune system. The reason why these foods weaken your immune system so much is they cause micro tears in the lining of your intestines and your gut. And the micro tears allow food from the inside of your intestine to get into the bloodstream. And so the more micro tears there are, the more food and feces that gets put into your bloodstream, and then your immune system is weakened because it has to use all of its resources to fight off all of those contaminants in the bloodstream. So your immune system, let's say it was this, it was this full, is now taken back because it has to fight off all this food allergens that are now in, in your in your in your blood so then when a cold virus comes in your immune system's weakened and you get sick uh, and a lot of people end up getting sick four or five you know maybe even there's some people that probably get sick <coughs> weeks on end and it's irritating you know it's frustrating you got to stay home you got to miss work you got to miss school you can't think straight you're cl cloggy so you want to avoid that and how you avoid it is basically eating a paleo-style diet. The more you remove the grains, the more you remove those, those legumes, the healthier you're going to be and the stronger your immune system is going to be. So, you know, you might think, I can't give up eating bread. I can't give up eating pasta or pizza. But the more you remove those from your diet, the stronger your immune system is going to be and the less likely you're going you're gonna to be to get sick. So. That's about 70% of your immune system. The rest is going to be made up from, um, you know, eating other good food and getting a good sleep. If you if you do all of that, your immune system should be fantastic, and you should not get sick. So, follow those principles and don't get sick this year.